Spanish referee broke the record for yellow cards in a World Cup in the quarterfinal duel and received criticism from both teams. Antonio Madulejos was criticized after his controversial performance in the duel between the Argentine national team and the Netherlands corresponding to the quarterfinals of the World Cup in Qatar 2022, in which he broke the record for the most yellow cards shown in a match of the World Cup. FIFA intervened and made a drastic decision with the referee. He will not continue directing for the remainder of the tournament. According to the data provided by the international soccer regulatory body itself, Madulejos was the referee who showed the most cards in the same match with 18 in total and a single expulsion at the end of the penalty shootout against the Dutchman Denzel Dumfries. In turn, he claimed a total of 48 fouls, 18 committed by the Albi Celeste and 30 by those led by Louis van Gaal. Lionel Messi, author of a penalty goal and who gave an assist, exploded against the referee Antonio Miguel Madulejos for his performance in the match. A lot of anger, I think it wasn't meant to end like this. I don't want to talk about the referee. Then they penalize you, you can't be honest. We were scared during the game because we knew what it was. FIFA has to review it. They can't put a referee who is not up to the task in this instance, said the captain, without a filter, at the end of the match. I think they would have to see, he said. There are many details on the field that you realize they want to tilt you, added the star from Rosario, referring to the referee, who admonished eight players from the Argentine national team during the match, and six from the Netherlands. Like Lionel Messi, Emiliano Martinez, the great hero in the penalty shootout, exploded against referee Antonio Miguel Madulejos. They come to me twice in the end. I don't know what the referee charges, he gave 10 minutes, they wanted us to tie. The truth is, the worst referee in the cup, by far, said Debu, hot. The Barcelona player remarked that the international judge changed his attitude in extra time of the match. The referee lost his way in overtime. It was really scandalous, complained the central midfielder. And then he added at a press conference before journalists from his country. The Argentine players surrounded him and he changed his attitude. He started calling fouls very easily against us. Look, Di Jong just wins a normal header and blows his whistle. They kicked the ball off our bench and he didn't care, the midfielder complained.